You guys are gonna think I'm weird, but it's been such an amazing ride with this one, literally. <laughs> so I'm gonna give it a hug. See you later, bud. I'll see you again. Safe to say that I slept like a baby. Sleeping in a cozy bed, especially after camping out for a few days, is the best. Once I got some food in me, I wanted to check out a couple of viewpoints near the resort. The Sutton Place Hotel had given me a complimentary lift pass for the day, and so I decided to check it out right after breakfast. The entry for the lift was just right beside the resort, which was very convenient. I went up right when they opened, so there were only a few people, which was nice. I hopped off the lift to see the very first viewpoint and this is also the stop where people line up for the pipe coaster, a fun 1.4 kilometer ride that goes up to 40 kilometers per hour. It's a must if you already have the lift pass as it's valid for the entire day. After spending a good amount of time at the first viewpoint, I hopped back on the lift to check out the second viewpoint. The second viewpoint offers a spectacular view of the mountain range in Revelstoke. There's also a couple of trails here and a restaurant where you can enjoy a meal with a view. Oh man, what a morning. I didn't go hiking, which is originally what I had planned to do, but I'm pressed for time. And a lot of the hikes here are, at least the ones that I want to do, are at least half a day. And I think it's just a good excuse for me to, to come back here. Big shout out to the Sutton Place Hotels. Your hospitality has been amazing. The service, the experience, just everything is on point. I just want to say thank you. And, and I really, really appreciate you guys having me here. But for now, I got to pack all my things because my things are everywhere and it's time to head back to Vancouver. So I finally made it back to Vancouver. I'm gonna return the car now. I'm at Richmond Honda. All right, so time to say goodbye to my adventure buddy. She's been so good. She's been good on this trip. Would it be weird if I hug this car? I feel like I've been through so much with this car and it's just hard to say goodbye, but Nothing lasts forever, so I'm gonna hug it anyways. I don't care what you guys think. She's been good to me. I'll see you again, buddy. I'll see you again. All right, so now I gotta get my stuff, all of my stuff, out of this car because I gotta return the keys to, to the dealership. So, how am I gonna do this? All right, let's do it. I don't really wanna take out everything out of this car one by one so why don't I just snap my fingers and let's see if that works all done